So a subscriber of mine asked me a great question, and I, I love questions like this because it allows me to hone into uh, certain areas of Christianity that are important, that need to be explained. And now this question is, what is the reprobate mind? And I'm going to go ahead and explain as precise as possible what this is. Now, the reprobate mind or the doctrine of reprobation is a doctrine which teaches that a person can reject the gospel to a point where God, in turn, rejects them and curses their conscience, curses their conscience. And the outcome of that is what we find in Romans 126. For this reason, God gave them up to dishonorable passions for their women exchange natural relations for those that are contrary to nature and so on. Now, the English word reprobate is from the Latin root word probare which means to test or prove. So in many ways, the sinner who was confined to the reprobate mind has been tested and proven to be worthy of reprobation due to their unwillingness to conform and or repent after being confronted with the truths of the gospel. I have stories about this in my own personal life. But 1 Corinthians 2.14, the natural person does not accept the things of the spirit of God for they are folly to him and it is not, and he is not able to understand them because they are spiritually discerned. Another great verse, 1 Corinthians 1.18, the gospel is foolishness to all those who are perishing. So essentially, the reprobate mind belongs to all sinners who are unconverted lost. Now, the degrees of depravity that encompass sinners in this world has everything to do with the grace of God or lack thereof. Paul Washer has a great quote from one of his older sermons that I'll always remember where he points during the sermon, he points at the congregation. He says, you are Hitler apart from the grace of God. Hitler was not an anomaly. Hitler was you apart from the grace of God. And so we see that it is God who controls exactly how wicked each sinner will be in this world. So I hope I've explained what the reprobate mind is. Um, if you have any further questions, leave them down below. Thank you for listening.